In this lecture, we'll continue talking about the sound wave parameter and we'll focus on the propagation speed. My name is Joe and I help people understand ultrasound physics and pass the SPI exam. The propagation speed is telling us how fast is a wave travel in a medium. And it depends only on the medium. Example, the speed in soft tissue is 1540 meter per second. And as you see here, we use the unit of meter per second. Why is that? Because we know that the speed is equal to the distance divided by the time. So that's why we can use any unit of uh, distance divided by any unit of time. Think about the propagation speed as if you are thinking about the highway speed limit. If the highway speed limit is 65 mile per hour, you cannot change the speed limit. Speed limit is something that you cannot change it. So same thing for the propagation speed. There is two factors of the medium that are affecting the propagation speed. The first factor is the density, the second one is the stiffness or the bulk. The density is uh, the concentration of the material in the volume. Remember, the density is one of the acoustic variables. And we said that the density is equal to the, uh, the mass divided by the volume. That's why we use kilogram per centimeter cubic for the density. If you look at these two materials, which one is having more density? Is A or B? As you see here, we have more dots here, and that means that this material is more dense. A speed is inversely related to the density. And inversely related to the density means that when the density increase, the speed decrease. And when the density decrease, the speed increase. A stiffness is how hard is the material. And when the stiffness increase, the speed increase. When the stiffness decrease, the speed decrease. And since I told you that the propagation speed is like uh, the speed limit on the highway, when the highway crowded with a lot of traffic, the speed limit in, uh, decrease. When the highway have less traffic, the speed limit will increase. Same thing the propagation. When you have more density, the speed limit decrease. When you have less density, the speed limit increase. Also, think about the stiffness like uh, the road. If you have a hard road like concrete and you have another road like uh, sand, you can drive faster on the concrete, but you will drive slower on the sand. That's why when the stiffness increase, the speed limit increase or the propagation speed increase. So the propagation speed increase when you have more stiffness and decrease when you have less stiffness. The speed limit on concrete is higher than the speed limit on the sand. In the next lecture, we'll continue talking about the sound wave parameter and we'll focus in the frequency, period, and the wavelength and how they relate to each other and also how they relate to the propagation speed. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.